the final winner. Next up is the B final. So in lane number one, Holly Stoll from Schrainer. Lane number two, Bailey Grinter from Edwardsville. Lane number three, Katie Minich from Birmingham. Elena Skillets in four from Greater Flint. Peyton Kiner was 10th last year from Pal Crosley Jr. Cincinnati, Ohio, season five. Lane number six is Emma Otten from Countryside, Ohio. Lane number seven, Caitlin Wheeler from Springfield, Illinois. And then lane number eight is Quinn Scannell from Greenwich, Connecticut. That's the lineup for your B final. Women's 200 yard backstroke. There you see you'll be as they've staged now they're in the water. Feet on the wall, hands on the starting block backstroke grips. And there they go. We'll take a look down here. Looks like in the lane number three. Pretty good start there for Katie Minich. We'll see if she can hold on now. It was a good start. But down here could be in lane number one with Holly Stoll or out there in lane number eight, Quinn Skinnell. And in lane number three, again, Katie Minich. So we'll see where they are at the 50. Give you a time. And right now it's tied for Holly Stoll and Katie Minich. Holly Stoll in lane number one. They're both at 2780. Minich and Stoll, they were 28.30 for Stoll this morning. Minich was 27.71. So Stoll, Holly Stoll is out a little bit faster out of lane one. But here comes Katie Minich. She's maintaining that lead right now at the 100 mark. And Minich was this morning. 57-34. She's out of Birmingham, Michigan. She's 57-66 tonight. Katie Minich from Birmingham, your leader. As she's trying to pull away from the field now. Her split at the 150 was 127-90 earlier today. And tonight she's at 127.71, so she's picked up very good turn there for Katie Minich coming off of that wall. Underwaters, you saw that last week with Ryan Murphy, the greatest backstroker in U.S. history at D1 Nationals down there in Georgia Tech. But here comes the field, but Katie Minich could have used a little more leg on that last 50 underwater, and here comes the rest of the field. She held the lead for a while, but it looks like it will be Elena Skellett. She goes 30.05, followed by Peyton Kiner, who split a 29.91, and then Katie Minich at 159. So 158.63 for Skellett. 